Hello, I'm Ling Chi. Today we're going to do a snow eagle egret on colored paper. So I done one on barley and one one on barley and one on khaki shun paper. The khaki shun paper has the um wash on the top like uh so you do the wash after it's dry so we're not going to show that today but um maybe another time we have sold quite a bit um tea color mulberry paper which you can also use to do this it's strong and uh, water resistant so you might have an easier time and then if you have pea paper or ma paper you are used to and you can also dye them with tea or coffee that's another solution so the brush wig first that we are doing on color shun paper And then the brush we are going to use, we are using flow brush and pre happy doll, or you can use happy doll, medium size orchid bamboo, um, mountain horse fine, and then last but not least either full lotus brush or large flow and um, the color we're going to use we still keep the companion set just for the accent part we're using very little this time and then uh, we have bleed proof white and ink i also prepare some um gold water kind of watery color from the uh, you can have use either sakura gold or uh, in a jar or uh, mecca gold if you have it but it's it's not something you have to have bleed proof white concentrated in a dish and um white from the either sakura um, Sakura white that which can mix with water diluted or you can use the companion sets um, color with a light um, add water to make it into kind of watery solution and then again that we're going to talk about glue water because for the beak it's very important it doesn't bleed and like you know all the shen paper has a tendency to bleed so for the beak part that we use one drop of glue it water which is water soluble glue into one tablespoon of um, water to <clears throat> into this solution so we'll load the brush before we load the black to for the beak so that will stop from bleeding. Okay, we'll start. <clears throat> While I'm on the camera to just to make sure that I'm double protected about bleeding, so I have the mountain horse fine and I load it with glue water and then instead of ink so I'm using the black in the companion set just make sure that I don't have any bleeding you can use ink um, but make sure you have glue water otherwise you won't get a clean beak at all so
Then I also load the pre-happy dot or happy dot with glue water and then vermilion. Now I load my flow brush with white, diluted white, and dry, and then tip with the um, bleed proof and blend. And I use the small brush I had before, the pre-happy dot or happy dot, and load it with um, the glue water and the ink for the eyes. So that also you don't want it to bleed. Right next to the, the head. Okay, so back on the flow brush with diluted white and leaf proof white and blend, make sure it can move. So what I wanted to do is to show the neck. And then shoulder. And the body. Okay, now I'm um using my full lotus you can use your um happy dot oh no i'm sorry large flow so full lotus or large flow Dip a little bit, go. So then I do. Let it go.
So now I'm loading my <clears throat> orchid bamboo with diluted white and concentrated white. So white again, so this is the feather. Tail feather. Then again, the glue water ink for the leg. And then my full lotus brush or your large flow brush, I load it with brown and then tip with ink and then this is doing with my um rock that he is standing on so uh while So I'm using a little bit blue with slightest ink to get kind of shadowy thing going on. The head. Too dark. Blue for the peak. So this is the E. Snow equal. 